Hello and welcome to another video from conversionskitchen.com and today we are going to be talking about CBD. This is the CBD drop shipping guide. So first thing to ask is what is CBD? Well CBD in case you're not familiar is the sister or brother chemical in the plant cannabis or marijuana. Uh, the two chemicals are CBD and THC. CBD is not psychoactive and is used for medicinal purposes, uh, for, for, for rest, for um, mood disorders, for mood enhancing, for sleep, for pain, for lots of different things. THC on the other hand, which is derived from the same or similar plant, uh, is psychoactive and gets people who ingest it high, as they say. So um, let's let's take a look here, just as a quick a quick look at a website here. This is an example of Fusion CBD products. If you want to check them out, see what they're doing. Uh, and we see CBD oil here. Um, they have lots of different things, capsules. We'll get to this uh, relief rub. So it's used. It's 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 claimed uses are pain and lots of different things, mood uh, mood altering and mood enhancing. So. Uh, let's see, in this article next we have the drop shipping process, but we're not going to talk about that right now because if you go to conversionskitchen.com, we have a really great article called How to Start a Drop Shipping Business in 2021, 0 to 22K in six months. So if you're just getting started with drop shipping or you're thinking about it, head over to conversionskitchen.com and have a look at this article, and we should have a video on this article very soon coming your way. So let's get back to CBD. So for the next question you might be asking, is CBD legal or is it legal to dropship CBD? Well, that depends on where you are in the world, unfortunately. Um, because of its similarity to the drug, uh, the prohibited drug, uh, cannabis or marijuana in a lot of places, it, some, some places prohibit the use and the selling of this product. So in the US, it's okay in all 50 states. All 50 states and you can sell it legally as long as the, the, the THC level um, is under a certain amount. So basically in, in any of hemp products or marijuana products, there will be some THC uh, and some CBD. So as long as the, the, the THC level is under a certain amount in the US's case, 0.3%, then it is legal there in the US. In Canada, it is not legal because it's still a prohibited, prohibitive, prohibited uh, product by the government uh, substance it's a prohibited substance so they prohibit the selling of that uh, so not possible in Canada in Europe it is okay if it's under 0.2 percent THC so they have more stringent laws on the level of THC and again it changes from country to country there although they have overarching laws it's definitely this is a situation where you need to do your own research Australia, unfortunately, it is not legal. So um, if you're doing drop shipping in Australia, forget about it for the moment, unfortunately. So these laws are developing all the time, so you never know what will happen in the near future. Asia is a similar uh, situation where different countries have different laws. So if you are in Asia, please do your own research about the region you are working in. Okay, so let's go on now. Let's take a look at some CBD products. So what, are, what, what, what did they sell CBD in? What kind of products are there out there? So they are edibles, as they call them. Um, so these come in gummies, the brownies, the different baked goods. Anything that you can kind of eat is called an edible. We have CBD topicals, which are creams. They can be used for massage or bruising or blemished skin, all sorts of different uses for that. We'll see, we'll see. Uh, this is Diamond CBD here. You see some examples of CBD oil cream uh, being sold here on this site. We also have CBD sublim uh, sublingual topical, which is basically a droplet, a dropper, a uh, liquid with a dropper that you can put on your tongue or under your tongue, which has the same effects. All these products have a similar uh, effect and uses, uh, apart from maybe the cream, which is more directed towards uh, pain on the skin or in the muscles uh, and we see some oils here this is diamondcbd.com capsules we have which you can just obviously swallow and we also have vaporizers which are the similar to nicotine vaporizers that are also becoming very popular these days uh, okay so let's just go on so 
So that's it, but that's just a, a, a quick overview of what's happening with CBD products and what kind of products can be can be marketed and can, uh, can you consider to dropship if you are on, in the right region. So now uh, just to remind you, if you are new to dropshipping, uh, because there is a part of this article that, is, that dives into starting a dropshipping business, but if you are new, I would highly suggest that you go to conversionskitchen.com and go to the article. It's called How to Start a Dropshipping Business. Uh, and I will provide all of the links down below in the description of this video. So go over there and have a look. And there's many other articles to look at there as well. And just to conclude, so is CBD dropshipping worth looking into at this point in time? Well, it, depending on your region, if you're living in the USA, it's probably a, a, a better option. Uh, depending on your region, that will affect, affect uh, your chances. So look into the laws in your region. How I would sum this up is, it's a new market. A new market means that you have less competition and the opportunities in the future are higher. There is a slightly higher risk associated with it because of the laws uh, around CBD and the changing nature of those laws. But the high risk, high risk in business often goes with high reward. And if you want to read the whole article, you can go over to conversionskitchen.com. That's the CBD dropshipping guide. We are Conversions Chef on YouTube, and all of the links will be provided in the description of this video below. So thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.